<laughs> Alright, so, like I was saying, um, if you've, and as we, we have to head now to the, oh, by the way, in case, again, you forgot, or more to remind myself on how to do this, what you do is you just head out to your map, and you'll notice the terminal security checkpoint over at number one there, and then you just, you just follow the map there, and that's pretty much the easiest thing to do, so onward to the holding area. So, yeah, what I was saying was, um... That if you remember that I was trying to work on this like many, 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 many videos back when I was first going through this, during when the game would freeze, like, almost all the time. Uh, yeah, well, good for you. But uh, I think that was probably like in the tens or something like that. I don't know what part I'm at now. I think I'm hitting, I'm right around, at the time of this recording, I think I've recorded up to 58, maybe? Don't quote me on that. So I don't know what part this is. But I know it's been a, quite a while. And, all right, look, the other terminal. Bow, Alun's doing some heavy lobbying for the Hanar to support the war effort. So he's clearly not indoctrinated. Who's opposing him? An unnamed Hanar recently posted here from Kajay. I'll check transit records for incoming Hanar. It all comes down to the war, and you trying to pull everyone into it. Would you rather the Reapers win? I'd rather spend whatever time I have left with KG. KG wouldn't want you to spend all your time plugged into that thing. All right, yeah, the reason I don't like moving is if you sometimes move to a certain area, you move to a different area, the conversation gets cut off. I mean, not like that very first time, though, when Shepard just didn't say anything, but fortunately the text was there, so all is well with the world. But, uh, yeah, this this mission was, <laughs> like, actually before I played, see, as I was trying to say before, this terminal was just to light up, and it was just really getting me in the back of my mind that, you know, I really really want to do this mission to for a sense of completion if you will but anyway this is what we've been missing out on the entire time i've got a list of new hanar arrivals bob forwarding it to you damn these are all face names the hanar names from the alliance raid are soul names and hanar soul names are private there's no public record can you get back to their personal communications on it maybe we'll find names there so how's the rest of the gang met up with anybody else Garrus is helping out on the Normandy. He never could pass up a good fight. What about Jacob? Haven't heard from him. See, Jacob could have gotten me back onto the Normandy. I thought you were happy with your memories of KG. Hey, I'm nostalgic, not dead. All right. All right, so again, nice little dialogue there as we continue on. So yeah, again, in case if anyone's forgotten, this is came from the uh, from one of the DLC missions. So. But I'm sure I said that many, many videos ago. All right, this is the last terminal. Bow. Here's the correspondence. If there's any mention of soul names, I've got it. A recent arrival, Zemendis. Soul name regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair. He was with the Alliance team that massacred the Batarians. He's been on special research assignment ever since. So he got his tentacles on some Reaper tech. Looks that way. I'm sending you the nav point for his office. I'll meet you there. Alright, so finally it comes down to this, so in case you're wondering where he's located, if you go up to uh, the embassies, you'll see John Dumbau, an off-site, you know, number five over there. So let's head up back upstairs. But yeah, this was really bugging me. I mean, clearly it was if, if I was willing to actually restart a brand new game just to get to this point. I mean, I think the game, or at least the in-game time was about four hours. To get to this point. I mean, I, I did it in a night. You know, skipped all the conversations and did all that, but... Actually, when I was playing through the original game as Femshep, when I beat it the first time, uh, I think there was another side mission I forgot to do because I just couldn't find it. Or whatever, for whatever reason. And, yeah, that... <laughs> it aggravated me for a while until I realized I got to the point of no return. So then after that, I didn't care. Anyway... So now we did all this, and so now we just head over here and look who is waiting for us. Alright, here we go. Zamandis? Or should I say, regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair? It seems this one has been apprehended, but confinement is irrelevant. The work of the Enkindlers cannot be stopped. Why are you trying to help the Reapers? 
We obtained information regarding the Enkindlers from classified sources. The Enkindlers? You mean the Protheans? Yes. As you are aware, Commander Shepard, the Protheans eventually became the Collectors, and the Collectors serve the Reapers. Ugh. You have got to be kidding me. Therefore, as a faithful servant of the Enkindlers, we too must serve the Reapers. You big stupid jellyfish. You know, I support religious freedom for all species, but that's just crazy. Your skepticism does not matter. When the Enkindlers uplift us as their chosen sapients, the galaxy will bear witness. You're insane, and we can't allow you to endanger your planet. We're taking you into custody. Your belief in your victory is mistaken. Our planetary defense network is largely automated. It can be disabled with a single virus. Which I have just uploaded. Damn it. Wait. A virus would be detected unless sent on low priority channels, which have a time lag. I may be able to block the upload. <laughs> you may be delayed. Help him. I'll handle this. Got it. Uploads disabled. Looks like we're in the... Wait. He's got some kind of failsafe. Get down! She was here the entire time. She was an old friend. I intended to arrest her. She helped me take down the Collectors. And she just gave her life to save the Hanor homeworld. Point taken. It was an honor to work with you, Shepard. When the time comes, I'll be there to return the favor. With a few friends. You can come out now. How'd you know? Lucky guess. There's no way you're recruiting me to fight in a galactic war. The Crucible Project needs technical experts. I'm not a scientist. No, but you're the best thief in the galaxy, and you can hack unfamiliar technology better than anyone. They could use your help. And think of it. All that expensive tech just lying around. It's not like they're gonna check your pockets at the end of the project. You say the nicest things. All right. I'm in. And Shep, nice working with you again. All right, so hopefully, if I'm looking at the time correctly, I think I managed to do that all in one video, so that's good. Anyway, so yeah, we stopped that big old jellyfish from uh, being stupid and destroying their own homeworld. Um, actually, that surprised me, too. I thought Kasumi really did die until they kept playing that scene, and then, oh, it was probably just a trick. And in fact, it was, as you saw. Now, just so you know, in the other game, when I go back to my other file... Oh, well, let me spin around. It looks like Shepard, so you can stare at Shepard for a second. Um, there's some, usually on Liara's, like, Shadow Broker computer, there's some intel, like some conversations, some emails that she picks up or whatever. But uh, since I can't do it on the other file, you will never be able to see those. But, that, you know, whatever. You can always look those up on the, uh, on the, on the old uh, interwebs. Or the extranet, as they like to call it in Mass Effect. In any case, I'm going to go ahead and switch back to the other file now. And yeah, when we come back, I will be on the Normandy. And welcome back to the Normandy. So, just to give you, uh, again, an update. I mean, this is more for me than you guys, because you guys can just watch the last video, <laughs> which I did not do. So we still have, regarding some of these side missions, the Apian Crest one, um, I just have to go over to Castellus and the Apian Crest. However, um, I've already maxed out the reaper alertness so there would be there's a bunch of reapers in there and i don't feel like trying to run from them and try to get it at the same time uh this is going to be for later on no one needs it yet this one as i said before in the previous video i cannot do this one this i will get later on um this isn't even available yet because the system isn't available so all that i have left is to go to tachanka to cure the genophage so also, I took the liberty of, I was at the, whatchamacallit, the Citadel before, but now we just go ahead and go here. So, let's head to the Shroud Facility to cure ourselves a genophage. 
But yeah, um, with that Apian Crest one, I hope I don't... Knowing what I know, what happens, you know, later on, I I hope I don't mess up that mission. Hostile detected at the landing coordinates. Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're going to be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, sir. New form of Reaper, Shepard. Using Shroud to poison Tuchanka's atmosphere. Problematic. They want to fight! They just got one. Primark, we're gonna need your help. That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. We're doing this for Palavin. No one said it would be easy. What do you have in mind? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Rex, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud facility, finish synthesizing cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. We've never faced a Reaper up close like this. Everyone on board? There's even a doubt? Let's move, Pijak. It's time to cure the genophage. Dalatrus? Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. And by now, I imagine Morden Solus has proposed using the Shroud. Are you spying on us? Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow your misguided sympathy for the Krogan to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the Genophage will end in lasting peace? We have to give the Krogan that chance. You can't condemn an entire race to extinction based on what might happen. What will happen is the Krogan will reproduce out of control. We uplifted them specifically for their violent nature, not their diplomatic skills. Another war is inevitable. What do you want, Dalatras? Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you are planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Rex believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible, and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. <laughs>